Hey guys, it's Davis from One Up. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to schedule a Google My Business post and also how to automate Google My Business posts from an RSS feed. So I'm on One Up. Uh, the URL is oneupapp.io. And I'm on the accounts page right now. So first thing you want to do is connect your Google My Business account. So you're going to just click this button and it's going to prompt you to connect your GMBA accounts. Once done, they should show up below on the accounts page. So I already have mine connected here. All right. And then after that, you click uh, schedule a post under the schedule post drop down. And then you choose your category and then you choose the account that you want to post to. So I'm going to choose my Google, my business account here. All right. And then down below, you're going to type the description. So this is what appears in the, the body of the Google, my business post. Um, so I'll say, check out our weekly specials. And you can add an image to your post. So let me find an image here. All right, here we go. Then this should upload onto our posts. All right. And then below that, we can choose our Google My Business call to action button. Um, so you can have no call to action button if you want, or you can add any of these buttons. So I'll choose a learn more call to action button. And then you can add your button URL. Um, so I'll just call it mywebsite.com. All right, and then at the bottom here, it's asking if we want to post this once or if we want to have this repeat. So with Google My Business posts, uh, they expire after seven days, uh, meaning they no longer show up in the Google search results um, after seven days. So it can be helpful to set posts to repeat weekly, um, but there's different interval options. Um, you know, you can choose once a month. Maybe you want four different posts, um, all repeating monthly, you know, set one week apart. So you have this continuous queue of uh, posts revolving uh, one, one week apart for each of them. So in this case, I'm going to set my post to repeat once a week. And then at the bottom, you can have it expire after being posted a certain number of times or stop after a certain date, but I'm just gonna leave it as is for now. All right, and then you can either schedule it out for the future or you can just post it right now. So I'll choose post now in this case. All right, now we're here in the queue of one up. So you can see that this post, um, it's set to go out, well, right now. So it should be posted in a moment. Um, but right here, you can see that it's set to be recycled weekly. So after posting today on March 22nd, it's going to post again on March 29th. Um, I can edit that if I want. I can edit the frequency or turn off the repeating feature, uh, but I'll just leave that for now. You can also edit the post itself. You know, maybe I found a typo in here that I want to change. Um, I can just click edit post to do that. All right, um, let me go to the search results page and we should see that post uh, live now. Okay, here it is. So let me open this up.
All right, so you can see here's our image, here is our text, um, here's our learn more button that links to uh, mywebsite.com, and that's it. Uh, so right now, like I said, it's set to repeat uh, once a week. So next week at uh, this same time, it will just repeat that post automatically. You don't have to do anything. So that is how you schedule a post with one up. Next thing I'll show you is how to automate your posts uh, via an RSS feed uh, using one up. So in schedule post, uh, you just click auto post from RSS feeds. That will take you to this page. So I can click add new feed and it's going to prompt me to add my uh, RSS URL that, uh, that I want to add. So um, let's see, I'll just choose this one because I know the RSS feed. All right, so I'm going to have hackernoon.com post to my Google My Business account. You can add other accounts too, um, like a Facebook, Twitter, uh, Instagram, if you'd like. But right now I'm just going to post to Google My Business. All right, and then right here it's asking um, how long I want the minimum interval between each post uh, to to post in this uh, from this feed. So with one up, what's going to happen is it's going to take the ten most recent posts from your RSS feed, and it's going to um, schedule them out. So if I want maybe, uh, let's see, an hour between each of those posts at a minimum, I would send an interval of 60 minutes. So if I wanted a few days, you know, I could add thousands of minutes. Um, that's not a problem. Um, but right now I'll just do every 60 minutes. Um, and then moving forward, so once it schedules that first 10, uh, those will be scheduled out at this minimum interval you set. Moving forward, any new posts that come to that RSS feed, they will um, automatically get posted shortly after they go live. One up just periodically checks your RSS feed for any new content that comes. Um, and then if like multiple new blog posts come at um, you know say the same time or you know a short time apart, one up will use this minimum interval that you already set for the um, the time between those posts. So they're not posted, you know, one after the other on your Google My Business account. All right, and then down here, it's asking if you want to have the post from the RSS feed repeat automatically. Um, so I can have each post repeat, you know, once a week if I want. I'm just gonna leave this on, on never for now. All right, and then I hit add. All right, and then here it is added right here. So now if I go back into the queue, I should see 10 posts from that RSS feed added. And here we go. So here's the first one. So this one will be posted. Um, right now so probably already posted the next one should be an hour after that so let me scroll down yeah you can see at 102 this one's set to post 202 the next one so yeah there, there'll be 10 of them um that 10 of the most recent posts from that rss feed will be scheduled automatically so if i go back into search results Let's see. Give this a second to update. Let's 
It's not showing the RSS feed yet, but let me refresh one more time. All right, and here it is. So you can see it will post, um, if, if the RSS feed has an image, it's going to post that um, on the Google My Business post. If your RSS feed doesn't have a featured image, then it might just show with the headline and the link. But um, if it does have an image, it will post it too. So uh, now moving forward, basically anytime there's a new post from this RSS feed that I hooked up, it will just automatically queue it uh, using one up to post automatically to your Google My Business page or pages if you have uh, multiple Google My Business accounts. Um, that's basically it. Uh, again, the website for one up is oneupapp.io um, and it's a free seven day trial to test it out and um, see if it works for you. Thanks a lot, guys, and have a great day.